The cactus you see here on the screen currently is a pokey. It is an actual living, breathing creature, which must be miserable because it lacks appendages. And that is a perfect segue into the anatomy. The pokey is a segmented creature boasting four sections, including the head. It is covered in spikes, as the name would suggest, which hurt all who touch it. There are also some spots that are just there because, and also the pokey has kind of a terrifying face. Look at it. He's planning something vicious, like turning off the Wi-Fi. So, now you know all you could ever hope to know about how a cactus looks. So next, let's discuss the behavior of said cactus. They sit there and hope some idiot runs into them. Oh. But occasionally they slide. Menacingly. And there are others that roll around, which is a really dumb idea because there's no way he's going to get back up. Physics. So, what's next? How about their achievements? Well, after many hours of research that actually happened that I'm not lying about, I found that they haven't done too much. They killed people, of course, because cacti are very deadly, and they've... existed? Oh, and there was this one guy that stole a sticker in a game we try to forget about. And now, hardships. Yeah, there's not much here either. There's the usual fireballs, Yoshis, blah blah blah, bloodbath, you get the picture. Now, let's move on to something sort of interesting. The subspecies. Let's start this off with... The Big Pokey. It's a pokey, but... Big. The Green Pokey. It loses its spikes and it just looks kinda dumb. The Poison Pokey. Take it from me, cactus poisoning sucks. The Pokey Mummy, a useless and weaker version of the Poison Pokey. The Snow Pokey. I feel like this is kind of ironic. And with that out of the way, why don't we interview a Pokey? Let's choose this generic one. So, uh, what's up? I'm here to interview you for our documentary. Tell me, what's it like being a Pokey? Uh, okay, I guess. How does not having arms or legs feel? On like a scale of 1 to 10? I'd say probably a bad. Okay, we'll pretend that makes sense and move on to the next question. Are people afraid of you because of your spikes? Not usually, because they typically only meet with the spikes once. Okay, and the final question is, why are you a gosh dang cactus of all things? Evolution is an amazing thing, man. Thank you for allowing me to interview you. Allowing? You threatened me with scissors. Okay, that's gonna wrap things up here. I hope you enjoyed learning about cacti. And next time, we'll take a look at something I haven't decided yet, so get hyped for that! If you enjoyed this documentary, then why don't you subscribe to Bowser Power for even more educational fun? Don't forget to leave a like! Bye-bye!